everyone. Good morning. It's uh, 10 56 a.m. Eastern Time, and we are part way into our journey to Nashville this morning. We have stopped off for a little bit of Bojangles, great biscuits. We are planning on being in Nashville 12 p.m. Central Time. Yes, we cross a time zone line on the trip, and it is raining today. Mm -hmm. Greg doesn't like rain. It makes him feel droopy a bit. <laughs> I'll make him smile. <laughs> See? <laughs> okay, we're gonna go with yard biscuits. See you in a bit. Hello, welcome to Nashville. We made it right on time. And there are a whole lot of people here. No surprise. And it is wet. Very, very wet. Let me give you a show of the atmosphere. everyone out in the vlogging audience. There are two Nicks in this picture. Right. This is Nick. That's Nick. That's Nick. Greg, which one's the real Nick? I, uh, <laughs> this guy's great. He's one of the uh, founders of the All Stripes. Yeah, hey, go United. Yeah, go United. This is a German lager. Nice. Not so warm, not so cold. Perfect. Okay, we are in the stadium. Pretty nice place. We're going to go find our seat. See you in a There he goes. Losing him again. Excuse me, I'm I'm very wet. It is raining. If there's one thing that I've always wanted to try more of, it's ballpark food. Here, here in the U.S., Josh, you probably know this. Lord and Cameron, I don't know if you know this or not, but here in America, ballparks have unique food items. They're staples. I think I found one of them. Let me introduce you to the prime rib Nash Chos. This is prime. This is prime rib with uh, tomatoes and sour cream and potato chips instead of nachos. And I am going to try one of these. Let me grab this one right here. Oh my goodness gracious! What have I done? <laughs> oh look at that! Oh that is so nice. Mm. Not spicy at all. I like it. It's very, very good. I'm going to go eat the rest now. By the way, Greg's just having a hot dog. Okay, get used to it being blurry. I mean, it is wet out here. Very, very, very wet. And I'm a little wet behind the ears. Not. I don't think we could sit out here for a half hour before the game even starts. No, we're going back inside. Okay, we are inside. The elements are out there. We're going to stay dry for as long as possible before this game starts. Yogi. Last ball, that's the last CS soccer fan and season ticket members to select the like jersey the team wears on the field this historic inaugural season. With the front... I'm going to put a line 
from a famous TV show that you like. I miss being dry. I miss being dry, Greg. I miss being dry. Anyone got a shammy they can send us in the past? Really? It's almost game time, though. Go United. Off. It's half time. No score at the half. The field is very wet and it is slowing down the ball. I mean, both, both, both teams are having to deal with this. It is some of the toughest conditions to play in apart from snow. But the ball even moves quicker in snow than it does on a wet, wet turf. Just hits the ground and goes splash. Yeah, very much so. Uh, I don't envy them out there. I don't envy anyone who has to sit in the rain. But we got to survive it for 45 more minutes. Halftime is short. <laughs> Are you my wet sponge? He doesn't like wet sponges. Not at all. Hey, but I'll tell you what, we're getting our money's worth for the club level seats. Unless we're somewhere dry for a few minutes. Alright, on to the second half. Sponge feels. My hair, oh my god. As Josh Willis would say, this is the hair you're getting. <laughs> We're back in the car, trying to warm up, and boy, this picture is foggy. I mean, <laughs> the, the lakes we go to to watch sports. I mean, the beautiful game in the rain. What can I say? I think the, uh, and going through the tweets after the game, I think the tweet that I identify with the most was, uh, it said, Atlanta United 3, Nashville SC 1, man of the match, Puddle. There are a lot of puddles. There are a lot of puddles. I mean, it's like, it's like playing, I mean, it could, it could be worse. It could be playing on wet AstroTurf. Ugh. We might as well be playing on a wet rug at that point. It's about what it was. Okay, so what are we doing now? Uh, going to check out a used bookstore. Once we get a little more dry. There's one bookstore we love down here. Yeah. What's it called? Uh, the Great Escape. Yeah, The Great Escape. 
Okay, so we're here. This is this is the Great Escape, just your standard used bookstore, and we're doing one of our favorite traditions. And all the time we've been together, we're crate digging, especially down in the soundtracks. So far, I found a Mission Impossible album I didn't have. Theme to the James Bond Thrillers Volume Three by the Roland Shaw Orchestra. Uh, hold on that thought. I gotta make a decision. Be right back. Alright, it's time for dinner. And we're at Demos, one of the best restaurants in downtown Nashville. We've been here before, so it's worth a return trip. And I invite Josh to turn off turn off the vlog now or eat. Your choice. Do you have any words for anyone? Yum. Yum. The password is yum. First clue is yours, 10 points. Great. You're one with the steak. No demos was good. Yes, very. Oh my god. You wouldn't think steak and spaghetti would be a good combination, but oh my god. Oh. Yeah, that's going to do it. We're heading home. You don't want to see us driving in the dark in the rain. <laughs> no. So if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell icon if you want notifications when we post new stuff. Yep. And uh, please, I implore you, please share our channel. We want to get to 100 subscribers. If you're watching this after we hit 100 subscribers, thanks. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> we love you guys, and we'll see you next time. Bye.